Gold traded in a very narrow range and closed the day in red. Power of levels again. I have mentioned 2830 on the downside, 4045 on the upside. Precisely, it respected the levels. I hope you all profited. Now, what to expect today? How to profit? We will see with the help of charts and indicators. If you are new to the channel, do subscribe to the channel to get the latest updates. Next update will be released before the US session. Do like, share and comment. And yes, if you think that the content is adding value to your trading decisions, become a member. Join the membership here on my channel. It's a great support. Let's start first to look into the early. On the early charts, gold is forming this flag here. This is a still a bullish flag formation. Any breakout beyond now 2040 levels certainly should be a good idea for us to buy. But then it has to break beyond 45, 48 zone. These two levels are critical. Now beyond 48 is where the bulls are waiting. Remember, after the rise here, after the breakout here, it is forming a good bullish flag. We have to wait for the breakout. It has also left a gap on the downside today. So 2030 is the level you should watch out for. Again, it is going to remain a great support. The stochastic overbought MACD trying to converge crossover. This may bring bullishness. RSI is flat almost. Volumes are uh, moderate coming to two hour charts. On the two hour charts, likewise, see after the drop, it is consolidating in this zone. Nice flag formation. A breakout is what you should look for for two. Also, similarly, rise and then on the minor time frames also. This is waiting for a. Thus, today, 2040, 2042 zone again going to play a major role. Only above which you can say that the bulls will try to take over. If you look at stock ISIC, this is rising, MACD is bearish trying to converge, RSI is flat. See, you can also learn this art of trading and you can also learn this art of simply analyzing the charts and taking your positions with profit. You can join my mentorship batch, 28 batch is starting on the first month, that is January 2024. Register yourself, now itself. Reach out to me for more details at Telegram or email. You can also find the details on my platform, www.forexfunda.com. And if you want to trade as per the signals, you can join my signals channel on Telegram. Coming to 3R chart, similar observation, nothing different. See, symmetrical formation. Now, see, this is what we had discussed yesterday, symmetrical formation. Look at this, look at this, same movement, same movement. Now, what preceded this was a drop here uh, with the rise here. It can follow with a drop. If it is bearish, it has to break below 2030, 2020 levels. And then we can see it hitting the bottom. But in general, this rise consolidation and if it breaks out it is going to give you a sim similar move on the upside so right now i can see symmetrical formation happening here and the direction it gives a breakout which is going to be the direction of gold for the near future a stock stick rising macd is bearish rsi is flat coming to four arch now another observation on the 4 hour chart, see taking the support from the 20 period moving average, moving average is trading with divergence and bullishness. Look at this, 3 candles, 4 candles, a reversal sign is seen and after the reversal, this is the first bullish candle. Once you see the next candle staying above 2038, in fact we can buy here at 2038 but we have to be watchful. Beyond 2038 is where we can see series of bullish candles specifically it needs to stay above the zone at 20 40 45 42 45 rather i will say it has to stay above the zone once the price is stays above 20 42 45 you can say that the bulls will take over the stock is here hitting the bottom and trying to bounce macd is bearish here this is something which you should be watchful on the four hour charts macd is also forming a flag a breakout is what will confirm the bulls there rsi rising coming to the daily before we look into the daily charts we have a webinar series coming sunday we are going to discuss what to expect from the markets we every sunday rather we discuss the future of markets for the coming week we take a holistic view of indices commodities dollar together along with the volatility index and try to find out try to dig deeper into the markets and i share the insights there i also take up your live questions on the live webinar do register for it also if this comes with a, an opportunity for you to have two live consultations with me these two consultations even one consultation itself can reap you profits there just visit the platform www.forexhonda.com for more details also this saturday we have a educational webinar coming up where i am going to give you the key strategies to analyze the markets and how to profit which indicator is the best everything we're going to discuss in this webinar do register for this free webinar again visit the platform www.forexvendor.com for more details or visit my free telegram channel for details here now let's have a look at the daily chart on the daily charts lower highs 
higher lows consolidation thus 40 42 again on the upside and 45 these three levels are going to play a major role in deciding the direction of gold now only worry point is it has started the day on a flat note and the median of the bullinger band sitting at around 2030 2030 is going to be a great support now see once the price is stays below 2030 see you will get at least 20 pips and then 28 is the major support so 2030 2028 zone is something you should watch out for this is going to remain a great great support for gold for the day also if you look at the movement here it is identically symmetrical and if it breaks below 2028 you can say that the price is not willing to stay bullish right now though i can see it forming a good flag and a breakout is what you should look for. but these are markets you have to think of both ways you do, should not think that it is only going to give a bullish breakout though the chances are high but still you have to be watchful the stock is stick flat macd is trying to converge crossover rsi is flat considering this i will recommend you to sell here at 20 32 levels but be careful of 2028 20, 20 30 levels only below 2028 20, we can say that the prices will turn bearish and we will look forward to 2024 20, 2018 and below 2018 20, a massive drop can be expected on the upside you can buy here at 2038 20, but wait for 40 42 and 45 three levels and then 48 fourth level see very nearby resistances means it is to put extra effort to sale on the upside we have to be very very cautious with the buying positions here at 2038 it is still to be traded with the stop loss at cost and keep shifting your stop losses once at 40 then at 2 at 42 so take your trades accordingly like share subscribe and comment do watch the next update before the year session thank you very much have a great profitable trading day ahead thank you